going on YouTube? I appreciate you guys for tuning in, man. Thank you. I appreciate the love and support you guys been giving me, man. Thank you for that. Um, I hope everybody out there is doing good, man. I wanted to talk about a few things today. The first thing I wanted to talk about was doing something that you're scared to do every single day. We should all be doing at least one thing that scares us every single day. If you're not doing that, then you're not growing. You can't grow by doing the same thing over and over again, and it's not challenging you, okay? You have to do something that scares you, something that puts fear in you, that, you know, something that makes you want to cringe, like, oh, man, hey, you know, I wish I didn't have to do this. I mean, I'm getting on camera. I, I get scared. I, you know, I get nervous sometimes. It probably shows, you know what I mean? But I'm gaining confidence because I'm doing it every single day. I may not do it. I'm not doing a YouTube video every single day, which I'm trying to get up to that. I'm trying to work my way up to that. But, you know, I'm getting on camera every day. You know what I mean? On Instagram, I'm putting out content every single day, Facebook, Twitter. But I make videos every single day. It's not always on here, on this platform, but I'm doing a video daily. All right. So, you know, you got to do at least one thing that scares you every single day. At least one thing. All right. Now, like I said, if you're not challenging yourself, then you can't grow. So you got to do things that you're scared to do. You have to. That's the only way that you're going to grow. That's the only way that you're going to get better. That's the only way that you'll conquer your fear of, you know, whatever it is you're trying to avoid. All right. So do one thing every single day that you're scared to do. All right. The next thing I wanted to talk about was you know taking life into your own hands now a lot of people seem to think that other people have control over their lives now granted a lot of us work a lot of us have nine to five jobs i'm not talking about that kind of control i'm talking about having can you know having the control over your life of being able to do what you want to do if there's something that you want to do then you need to go out and do it you don't need anybody's permission to do that one thing that you're trying to do, all right? You don't need permission. You don't. You don't need any permission from anybody to do whatever it is that you want to do. If it's something that you love and something that you're hungry for, something that you're starving for, you don't need anybody's permission to do it. You don't. Who, who's, you know what I'm saying, permission are you looking for? Whose permission are you looking for to do that thing that it is that you want to do? I, I really don't understand that mindset. Why people get caught up in, oh, man, I, you know, this person, you know, uh, might not want me to do this or, you know, this person, you know, uh, frowns upon me doing this who, who cares what other people think man stop caring about what other people think so much that's the problem you're worried about other people's opinions way too much you value other people's opinions way too much man and you don't need to do that do whatever it is that you want to do don't worry about what anybody else thinks about it because as long as you're happy with doing that thing then that's all that matters that's the only thing that counts all right so Keep that in mind. Don't allow other people's opinions to stop you from doing that thing that you want to do. Don't allow anybody to stop you from doing it. Anybody at all. All right. The last thing is just being grateful for what you have in life. Be grateful for where you are. Don't worry about what other people have. Other people are going to have more things than you. Other people are going to be doing better than you in life. Other people are going to have more success with certain things. But that doesn't mean that you can't attain that same success or be at a higher level than that person. But you have to believe in it. You have to believe in your heart that you can be more successful than these people, right? Or be at the same level. But strive to be better. You know, if you have mentors, strive to be as good as them, if not better. That's what you need to be striving for, all right? So always keep that in mind, man, all right? I appreciate you guys for tuning in, man. Thank you so much. I appreciate the love and support. Stay blessed out there and be great, all right? Love y'all.